Hey guys, it's Rubix, and I'm gonna show you how to make the shatter transition. Uh, so let's start off. Uh, you need After Effects. So what you want to do is you want to go to the end of your last clip and go around 20 frames. So actually, that'd be good. Uh, whatever you'd like, mine's around. 50 frames, you can use that. And what you want to do is you just want to search shatter and put it on the layer that you're kind of transitioning. Uh, go to render. Um, let's see. So mainly what you'll see is just this breaking. Uh, you don't really want that. You want to go to rendered. Just go to effects uh, and go to shatter. Um, you can change the shape if you like. Uh, I use bricks. You guys can use whatever. All right. So, Melly, what you want to do is once it's all shattered. Um, mainly just grab the clip, if I close this, uh, just go to project, and, uh, drag in the same clip, and just go right when it ends to shatter. Right. Here. Oops. And you want to put this under here. And you just want to line it up with that. So it'll mainly look like this. Not that cool, but yeah. And then you just want to end this round right here. Hold on, you just gotta find where the bricks go away. Uh, you can also uh, change where the bricks go away. But yeah, so that's about it. I'm just gonna render it out and show you guys what it looks like. Alright, so um, here's what it looks like. Kind of glitchier now. I'll just wait for it to load. Oh, there we go. So yeah, it's kind of a transition to both of them. Yeah, they're mainly the same clip. I didn't mean to do that, but yeah, that's mainly what it looks like. So, subscribe, rate, comment, and bye.